something that if you've got some experience as an adjuster and you're pretty good, you got your brain wrapped around this, you got the customer service and you know, you you know that you need to optimize, you know, and um be always be building your skills and all that kind of stuff. Um another thing that you can do um is essentially start your own IA firm. And what that looks like to start is there are a lot of insurance companies out there that don't have staff adjusters and they don't use IA firms. They will hire independent contractors directly or they, they or they will have some staff adjusters and they don't use IA firms, but then they'll have a handful of like, I work directly for ABC insurance here in you know Duluth, Minnesota. Right. Then I just handle stuff in the north half of the state. There's a lot of that out there. Right. And you can start building up a business where you are a direct to carrier adjuster, independent. Right. And this is where you might be able to start scaling things kind of beyond what, you know, there's there's limits to what we can make as adjusters because it's kind of a, you know, you're getting paid for your work, but if you can multiply yourself, right? So you, you build this relationship and then you bring on like an est- somebody who's just going to write your exact estimate estimates after you figured out exactly what these guys want, train somebody else how to do that. And then you can do more scopes, right? And then maybe you got two people doing that under you, right? And then maybe you, you know, you've got the scoping piece down and then you hire a scoper or maybe these people are doing it. They're just doing the scoping and writing, whatever it is. The next thing you know, you've got a half a dozen or you've got 12 people that are running around doing claims for you. And you've worked out, you've got this, this by then you're going to have a CPA and a bookkeeper and you work out your own split and everything. And you're an LLC and you got insurance and all this kind of stuff, right? And you're doing claims for ABC insurance up there in Duluth, plus four other carriers, right? Just local guys or, or regional companies, right? Or even there's some national companies that do the same thing. And yeah, I know one big national company that will actually go direct to, I mean, they use I yeah. firms, but you can actually, they'll give you direct work. And for you guys, if that's something that appeals to you, that's, that's, it's, you're, you're becoming a business now. It's like a real business business, not just like, you know, well, you're a gesture, you're a business, which you are, but figuratively in some aspects, but you're now, if you do this, then you're legit business, right? You've got an attorney, you know, that is on call for you. You need to join the National Association of Independent Adjusters and attend their conferences because those that's where you're going to meet other people that do that, right? And if that's something that interests you, attend their, their national conference. There's one coming up in May. Um, they have regional conferences throughout the year, and you're going to meet a lot of people that do that. When I've been to their, a couple other conferences, um, and I've interviewed a lot of people from there, and you're going to find that the exhibitors are all carriers, right? Lloyd's is there and a bunch of, it was all kinds of carriers, right? And then everybody else are like either one man band, I for, he's an IA firm to up to like several dozen people or maybe 50 people. There's, they're the kind of the smaller IA firms go to that particular conference and they hop knob and everything. NACA is going to be like from, from, the biggest of those up to like the big, big boys like Pilot Crawford, et cetera, right? But the NAIIA, the National Association of Independent Insurance Adjusters, NAIIA.com. Check them out if that's if, if you're mid-career and you're like, you know what, I want to kind of take this to the next level and I, I don't really want to be climbing roofs so much anymore, but I want to like, maybe I want to start my own firm if that ever popped in the back of your mind, attend that conference. So what does it actually look like when adjusters with decades of experience between them scope a hail damaged house? On video, what about how to actually do a claim in Xactimate? What is civility and how do you even get started in it? What if there was one place, one huge and expanding library of property claims adjusting videos showing how it's done? What if there were also complete Xactimate certifications as well as the latest and most up-to-date Xactimate mobile training? You know, what if? What if the dream was a reality? Get started for free binging all the desk and field claims adjusting videos you can stand right now at adjustertvplus.com. Think of it as a virtual ride-along. Speaking of ride-alongs, click here to get right along to the next video. Because it's a, well, do you see how it's it's a pun, you see? Ride along. Get it? Right. Just move right along versus ride along. It's right along. Get right along to it.